In this video, I'm going to teach you a very useful tutorial on how to download and install HP LaserJet 1018 printer driver in Windows 11 PC or laptop. So without any further ado, let's begin. So firstly, you need to proceed at the description box below. You would be able to see a link there that is being attached. All you need to do is you need to copy it. Once you have copied it, please directly navigate at the button search bar and type for Chrome. Once you've typed it, okay, and man, I mean a best match would appear, please click on Open to continue. So in a while, you would be redirected to the Google Chrome browser. All you need to do is you need to wait until you are being navigated here, okay, and everything are set before you proceed. Once everything are set, please navigate to the Windows search bar and make a right click and go with the spaced icon. Once you have pasted the link that you have copied, click the Enter key so that you would be redirected to the result. So you would be able to see a window like this. All you need to do is you need to wait until you can see an attachment file where you can download it. So from here, please read to the top of that. You can see their download. Cloud, click on it and go download as a zip file. And eventually it will now start on the downloading process. Please wait until this would be done. Okay, the process or the progress or the process, yes might be depend on the speed of the Wi-Fi that you are currently connecting. So please wait, be patient up and waiting and wait until this would be completed before we proceed to the installation. Okay, so once done, please navigate at the upper left side of that. You can see this one. Okay, click, click on it and go with download suspicious file. Click on this folder icon and go with this one. So click on this folder icon to show it into the location where it is being placed to or saved to. Make a right click here. Okay, and from that on, click on this cut icon to copy it. Okay, and let's move on to the desktop. So please make a right click here with the desktop and go with the spaced icon the moment you have based the zip file you need to unzip it so there are two ways in how to do such you can double tap to it or you can simply make a right click and go with the winrar tool or extract all and that way you would be able to unzip the file so go with it and once it is being extracted please wait until it would be extracted okay so please set aside Okay, and let's move on to this one. So from here, please navigate to the button search bar and type for settings. You can also press Windows key and I key together and then that way you will be able to bring up the settings window. So once a best match would appear, click on open to continue. So this is the time that we need to install the driver that we have downloaded. So we just have to wait until everything are set here. And once everything are ready, navigate to the left pane where you can see Bluetooth and devices. So once you bring up the Bluetooth and devices, please select for this one, which is printers and scanners. And you would be able to see this one, click on add device and wait until you would be proceeded to the manual installation of the driver. So click on add manually and wait until a new window would show up, which is this one. Go with add the local printer or network printer with manual settings. So click on next and it will ask you to use a printer port select any of this usb board in my case i'll be selecting usb 001 so click on next go with have disk click on the browse and from here you need to navigate to the desktop where our extracted file has been located and double tap to this one double tap and it will show you the driver click on open click on ok and it will be added here so please select on this which is 1018 driver so click on next go with next and it will now start on the installation so all you need to do is you need to wait until this would be done okay
Once done, if you would like to allow for printer sharing, you can turn this on or you can turn the other on if you don't want to. So go with next and if you would like it to set it as your default printer, you can check the box and you can also check if your printer is working properly by clicking on print a test page. So go with finished and there you have that you have just successfully installed the HP LaserJet 1018 printer driver in your Windows 11 PC or laptop. So close the window and you're good to go. So if you think this video helped you a lot, then please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button as well as the bell icon to be updated for more tutorials like this. Thank you for watching this video and have a good day everyone.